welcome to my youtube channel kadam academy i prakash kadam here today to give you the wonderful study on this vibration subject first we'll go with the fundamentals of vibration vibration in everyday life we can observe from these various pictures i will show you pointer these are the various systems or machines we are using day daily life and we are playing the music so friends fundamentals are very necessary to clear you your points learning outcomes of fundamental of vibration after completion of this video you are able to understand and learn what why should study vibration first that must be clear to you and understand basic concepts of vibration and understand find causes and effects of vibration learn different terminology of vibration we'll see in the next video see why should study the vibration the tacoma narrow bridge see here this is the bridge uh, collapsed due to the wind induced vibration on november 7 1940 this is the bridge see due to the wind it will vibrate like this why it was happened resonance is the process in which the an objects in this case bridge natural vibrating frequency its natural vibrating frequency is when uh, equal to the wind frequency then what, what will happen it will get collapse identical frequency will match will collapse similar example one more example aloha airlines flight this flight is 243 number and pretty crack failure suddenly happens this is the aloha before the crack pretty crack and this see this is the portion is break out that's why we have to study the vibration these are the damages causes but similarly the usefulness of application of vibration is there vibration is generated in intentionally in a component either concrete Uh, compactors ultrasonic cleaning baths or pile drivers for example vibration testing machine or impart the vibration to objects in order to test their resistance and function in the vibration vibratory environment also the structural dynamics has a wider scope than the vibration see these are the few examples usefulness of the vibration how the vibration are used you can see the various applications this man is playing the guitar okay there is also usefulness of the vibration basic concept of vibration is what oscillation oscillation means what it is a to and fro periodic motion about the mean position about the mean position when it will have oscillates suppose in mechanical system or any mechanical uh, operator machine is there oscillations are called vibrations okay we, we call here the oscillations or the vibration vibration or oscillation are both are same vibration is the motion of particle or body system connected the body is displaced from the position equilibrium see in the other words it also defined as to and fro motion of body about the mean position so we'll see one example it will clear you so this is the spring mass system motion of mass attached to the end of the spring this is the uh, wall this is the uh, bottom portion here spring is there and here mass is attached once we give the force f when the force f is zero that will be displacement is zero here x is zero see here the motion of mass attached to the end of spring similarly simple pendulum motion these are the mechanical systems or uh, we can say simple mechanisms okay the simple pendulum is the bulb bob is attached to the string okay and it is rotated by angle theta here theta and this bob is swung to left at angle 60 degree and release okay, it will rotate like this okay this is from vertical line but it does not stop there It will continue to go on. It continues to the right traveling 
to the shutter angle than reverse itself. The swinging of pendulum to and fro from mean position. This is the red line is the mean position, and this is the dotted line is the mean position. The to and fro motion that is oscillation or vibration. To clear you, this is the basic concepts always remain your mind. Okay, friends. Next causes of vibration. So what are the main causes of vibrations? Unbalanced force in the machine. Okay. These forces are produced from the in the machine. See, this is the properly not attached. This uh, coupling or bearings or this drum or the pump. Okay, it's properly not attached. That will also create a vibration. Unbalanced forces in the machine. Dry friction between the two meeting parts. Two meeting parts are there. The surface of this uh, wooden board, okay, this curtain, and the surface. Vibrating is vibration occur due to the dry friction. Next is the external excitation. These excitation may be periodic or random or nature of an impact produced due to the this external vibrating system on the vibrating system. This uh, vibration due to the earthquake. Okay. These are the responsible for the failure of the uh, the seismic uh, resistance vibration control and the base location. Okay, due to the earthquake, the building will be get vibrating. And fifth is the winds. Okay, this may cause the vibration of transmission or telephone lines. Also, due to the wind, already we are saw that example of the bridge. Okay, See, this is the one for my rear wing. Observe this rear wing vibration in this Ferrari F1 car. It is vibrating like this. So these are the what are these causes of vibration? Unbalanced forces, dry friction, extra excitation, earthquakes, and winds. Now you see the effects of vibration. Effects of vibration are tissue stresses will be developed inside the body. The what are the bodies or parts are there? that there will be excessive stresses due to the sudden forces will be there. Undesirable noise, noise will be created. And due to the looseness of parts, will also break or will get removed from that part. Okay. Parts that are complete failure of the parts may be occur due to the effects of this vibration. In spite of this, all harmful effects Vibration camera does not some uses also, and the uses are like a musical instruments, vibrating screens, shakers, stress relieving. These are the some usefulness of the vibration. By using vibration, you can using the so friends, you like my the channel. This is the end of video, and after this, what are your top three takeaways from this video? You have to write and the learning you always learn by self assessment only thank you very much friends for observing my lecture and continuously like my video